good afternoon. The uh, Speaker of the House, Speaker Martin Romualdez, the members of the cabinet that are, are here with us, both of those who are part of the delegation and those who are going to hold down the fort while we are away. And of course, uh, Madam First Lady, uh, District Representative Antonino Calixto, Pasay City Mayor Imelda Calixto Rubiano, good afternoon. Uh, the Armed Forces Chief of Staff, Lieutenant General Bacaro, uh, the uh, Philippine National Police Chief General Rodolfo Asurin, and uh, my fellow workers in government, ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon. I will depart today for Phnom Penh, Cambodia, upon the invitation of the Cambodian Prime Minister, Minister Hansen, to attend the 40th and 41st ASEAN summits and related summits from the 10th to the 13th of November. It is my first time to attend the ASEAN summit as a leader, the highest policy-making body of ASEAN. In the next few days, the leaders of ASEAN member states will discuss and provide policy decisions on current political security, economic and socio-cultural socio -cultural developments, as well as global issues that are affecting Southeast Asia and this, this region and beyond. We will also hold summits with ASEAN's dialogue partners, including Australia, Canada, China, Japan, India, the Republic of Korea, and the United States to review existing and new areas of cooperation and exchange views on the regional and international issues. ASEAN has always been a cornerstone of Philippine foreign policy. And through these summits, I will convey the Philippines' continuing support for ASEAN centrality, for Cambodia as the current chair of ASEAN, and for Indonesia as the incoming chair of ASEAN next year. My participation will promote and protect Philippine interests in ASEAN. We will emphasize regional cooperation on maritime security, climate change, food security, health cooperation, and economic recovery, amongst others. We will also address regional issues, such as the pandemic and the situation in Myanmar, developments in the South China Sea and the ongoing conflict between Russia and the Ukraine among other important matters. And we will also be having bilateral meetings with some of my counterparts in ASEAN and ASEAN's dialogue partners. I will seek further cooperation in key priorities of my administration, as well as how to explore what we can do to come together to address the most pressing issues of the region. I look forward as well to meeting with the Filipino community in Cambodia. The ASEAN way, such as the mutual recognition of our contributions to each other's nation-building efforts, is very much alive in the Kingdom of Cambodia. I have spoken often about the importance that I put to the partnerships that we make when, as we go forward and start to uh, live the future of uh, the new global economy. And uh, I think uh, this is going to be a very, very good opportunity for us to forge new partnerships and to strengthen those that have already, be, that have already existed for very long time. And this is the, it is also an important, uh, it is an important ASEAN conference specifically because this is the first time ASEAN has been able to meet after about three years, and uh, that will. Uh, uh, that adds to the importance because very much has happened in the past three years which we need to discuss and we, uh, which we need to decide upon how we, member nations of ASEAN, will jointly move forward. And so this is uh, the purpose of the trip and once again we will promote the Philippines not only as an investment center, not only as a tourism center, but as a partner a global partner for our ASEAN member, member nations and for all our friends around the world who will be joining the ASEAN conference. And with that, uh, I just uh, would like to uh, thank 
uh, all our ASEAN partner members for the interest that they have shown in the new policies that we have uh, established here in the Philippines since I took office. So with that, uh, I think it, we have a very good foundation on which to build upon within ASEAN and without ASEAN. Thank you very much. Good afternoon. Mabuhay po kayong lahat.